go to new part we say header so for header i'm going to choose the part references is j and then click ok so this is the header so i will use a line or rectangle so line this is for one this is for two okay we will add two pin connector right click and mode so we'll add two pins here you can add two, using the pin array also you can add it so click on the pin array so starting name will make it one and starting number one total number of pins you make it two if it is 10 15 20 the total number of pins you can add it so increment one one and the pin spacing is one means to the one grid so line and I'll make it short here instead of line and then click OK. So you, you can see the two pins automatically. It is up, uh, you can see the two pins automatically and then click it. I click add more and just drag it inside. So these are the two pin connectors. So go to options here, the part preferences, uh, go to uh, the pin name visibility make it false and then make it false click ok so if you want uh, if you want pin numbers to be visible uh, just go to the port preference spot properties uh, pin name visibility or number visibility we make sure which one you want it if you want the name visibility so the name visibility will come outside the pin if you want the pin visibility pins are coming which are which are inside so what i will make it names uh, numbers i'm going to make it false and the name i'll make it visible so it will come inside you can see the inside number so i'm going to right click here save this one and then close it so go to uh, the library this main library is having the three components here so capacitor header and then register so we'll see header header is updated to the library you can double click and you can use it to the library